next guest has his comedy special, Perfectly Stupid, available now at perfectlystupid.com. Please welcome the very funny Kurt Brownoler, everybody. Hello, thank you. Uh, so, I have two kids. Uh, which is so much more than one. <laughs> I, I don't know if I like who I am with two kids. I love the kids, uh, but recently I screamed at my entire family at the dinner table, I don't care if everyone's crying, I'm eating. <laughs> I don't wanna be that man. And when I had one kid, if someone asked me, hey, should I have kids? I was like, yeah. But now when I have two kids, if someone's like, should I have kids? I'm like, don't talk to me. I have 15 minutes to drink this vodka soda before going to bed because every minute that he sleeps, that I don't sleep, he gets stronger than me. but I wanna be a good dad. Uh, I'm trying, I'll tell you a story. There's a gas station near my house. It has a small handwritten sign on one of the pumps that says, please replace nozzle to pump before driving away with it. <laughs> and I thought that was funny. You know, I laughed at all these idiots who were driving away with the pump still in their car. <laughs> and so when I drove away with the pump in my car, <laughs> I was bashful. A little embarrassed, you might say. I didn't even know I did it, okay? Hopped in my car, blasting my meditation app, and just <laughs> took off, yanked it right out of the thing, and immediately pulled an illegal four-lane U-turn. <laughs> All the oncoming traffic was like, bah, 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 and I was like, oh, screw you, nerds. It's a U-turn. I gave them all the middle finger. Meanwhile, spewing gasoline across the street. And then I made a right and I got an even bigger highway, started going very fast. And mind you, I have a tail. Just ba -da 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 -da. And a big white pickup truck pulls up next to me and starts honking at me. And I was like, it's a U-turn! And he's like, roll your window down. I was like, what? He's like, you drove away with the pump in your car. And I was like, oh, you drove away with the... So I did. And then I was very embarrassed. I didn't know what to do. I'm on a highway. So I just pulled over to the side of the road and he pulled over too. And then I got out of my car and he got out of his car. And mind you, I'm deeply embarrassed. It's essentially like I just crapped my pants and he like followed me into the bathroom like, hey, did you crap your pants, man? Hey, how much crap is in your pants? Hey, why you think you crapped your pants earlier? <laughs> and I was like, what do you want? And he said, do you need help? And I realized I had a choice as a dad. You know, I could act like men have acted for millennia. I could lash out like a wounded animal, or I could be vulnerable and admit, yes, I screwed up and I do need help. And so I looked at this man offering this olive branch of help and I said, no! And then I got in my car and drove away. Uh, and I, you know, at first I looked at the car and I realized, oh, I have uh, gas. I pulled it out of my car and I was like, this is filled with gas still. What would be very useful uh, would be a pickup truck, but that guy just uh, told him to go screw himself. <laughs> so then I had to walk with it in my arms along the highway, like a big dead snake, back to where both gas station managers are standing outside waiting for me. And then I just laid it at their feet. And I was like, what do we do now? And they're like, we don't know. There's no form for this, pal. Uh, turns out it costs $350, uh, which is honestly a lot less than I expected. Uh, and you know what? They're designed to just pop right off. So you can just do it. It doesn't matter. You can just do it. <laughs> honestly, if you turn it into a comedy bit, maybe you'll get on The Tonight Show. Thank you.
Stupid is available at perfectlystupid.com. We'll be right back, everybody. Hey, hey.